Necessity and invention, that's the theme that we're going to get into today. All of us process ideas differently. We form connections. In many cases, are very unexpected. And I hope the same happens with you here today. This is a quantum processor. This will drive the next generation of computing and future progress in modern biology and medicine. You might think there are many things that I can't do because I cannot see. 51 feet to the door and keep straight. Cognitive assistance. It understands our surrounding world and whispers to me. I believe that play has the power to fundamentally change the way that children learn about their health. I recognize that humor isn't for everyone. It's only for those of us who want to have fun, enjoy life, and feel alive. <laughs> and here's to the algorithms that are helping us get there. Does anybody want to know how to manufacture desire? I'm doing it to you right now. <laughs> that bit of the unknown, the bit of mystery, causes us to increase focus and engage. And now today, we're taking biotech into a digital era. Why not use the food microbiome as a natural, built-in sensor to tell us when food is unsafe? So we have sensors linked to wells, intermittent mobile data from humans, weather data that we use to build these digital aquifers. So California, whenever you're ready, Africa has got a solution for you. <laughs> we are not going to live in a world without plastic, so we might as well figure out a way to make it work for us. We have an unprecedented level of control over our materials. Thermoset. This plastic is going to be a part of the solution. This is my collection. I am a sneakerhead. Sneakerhead data is kind of my life. What if we could buy sneakers exactly the same way as we buy stock? What if there was a stock market of things? Modern financial services do not have to remain a fast world privilege. We have the tools and we have the creativity to give every person the access to credit that they deserve. Thank you.